So, hello, friends of the Olsi Drape. We are here in Salzgottentühle, close to the DSV breeding station in the northwest of Germany. As you can see here, our Olsi Drape developed really nice over winter. Uh, you have seen a video already from this field directly at the sowing. So, now we have a knee high Olsi Drape. We can even see some first flowers here and there in some very early varieties. Um, we had in the last weeks temperatures between minus 3 degrees in the night and maximum 10 degrees uh, on the day. Last week we also had 10 millimeters of rain here. That helped really much also that the fertilizer was washed into the soil. Um, now it starts really getting warm. So today we had up to 15, 16 degrees and we can see it here also in our yellow traps. Uh, that of course every farmer should observe right now uh, not just here but I think in many parts of Europe we have uh, similar conditions right now it's getting warmer oil seed drape is getting also more into a, in the bud stage also where we see already the um, pollen beetle from now on but we also have so far not have had any big flight also of the stem weevils so that's why when we then look at here our yellow traps and we have two yellow traps here so one standard yellow trap and this here is already a prototype of a new yellow trap with a camera so that I can see also from the office already if we have a flight here of insects uh, and in both yellow traps now we have found the first stem weevils uh, so we found at least two free stem weevils this is still below the threshold for prote plant protection and insecticides but uh, nevertheless I think in the next two days we will get here the threshold uh, also with the stem weevils and on the other hand here in this yellow trap I can directly see also around 10-15 pollen beetle already so I think here on this field in maybe the three days uh, we will make a combined plant protection here with an insecticide against uh, stem weevils and pollen beetle uh, with a little bit of a fungicide here um, like a tebuconazole for example as here and there I can see a bit of light leaf spot uh, on the plants and of course we will also add an, about one to three liters of bore on this and then we have a very good timing of this mixture um, of plant protection and then we are quite safe I would say here already up to the flowering treatment.